This video will walk you through the Startup Wizard Quick Start Guide. Before you begin, ensure that you've completed the steps outlined in the previous segment. Hardware Quick Start Guide. You can access your modem or Wi-Fi. Your NVR is connected to a display, and both are powered on and visible. You have internet access available to create an email for your NVR. When you first turn on the NVR, it will automatically boot to the Setup Wizard's language selection screen. Select the language, and then select Next to continue. Select OK to continue or choose a different resolution. Then, select Next. Next, enter a new password with a minimum of six characters. Now enter it again to confirm it. Make sure to write the password down somewhere safe. Next, enter an email address to receive alerts, etc. Then, select Next. Next, confirm your language selection. Now, select the correct video format for your region. Then, select the appropriate resolution for your display. Next, select the appropriate time zone for your region. Next, select your preferred date format. Then, select a 12 or 24 hour time format. Next, give your DVR a relevant name or leave it as is. The QR code and P2P ID are unique identifiers for your recorder. You can use them later when configuring the Swan Security app. Now, select Next. The device list displays technical information and camera display names. To rename the cameras, click the display name to display the keyboard. Then change the name to something easily identifiable in the Live View screen. Now, select Next. To enable email alerts, ensure the email box is checked. Leave the Setup tab on Auto. In the Sender field, insert a sender name or leave the name displayed. In the Receiver field, the email address entered in Step 1 will be displayed. You can add two additional addresses to send alerts to. Now, select Test Email. If the test is successful, you'll see a notification. Next, check your inbox to ensure the test email was received. If it's not in the inbox, make sure to check the spam and junk folders. If you received an error, ensure that you've entered the correct email address and password and check all cables and connections. Then, check the back of the NVR to ensure the LEDs above the Ethernet port are flashing. If not, unplug and replug the cables. You may also want to try a different port on your router. Also check your email settings to ensure access for less secure apps is enabled. After receiving a successful test notification, select OK and then Next to continue. Now, tap Update Now to sync the date and time with the server. Then, select OK. Next, check to see if the system date and time are correct. Now, select Next. If Daylight Savings Time applies to your region, select Enable. Then, select the amount of time increased by Daylight Savings Time. Next, select the start and end times. Now, select Finish, then click OK to exit the wizard. Congratulations! Your NVR is ready to record video upon motion detection, send email alerts, and is ready to connect to the Swan Security app. You're now ready to download the Swan Security app for your Android or iOS mobile device. Watch the segment Swan Security app for more information.